Hiya there and welcome to Loki Collectibles. Right, I'm still reviewing the Del Prado Locomotives of the World collection. This was a hundred issue, you know, you got them every two weeks from the news agents, you would have got a magazine with them as well, and one of these cool models. They come on a plinth, you know, they're made of plastic, they have metal bottoms, so the wheels and everything like that is metal. You can actually take these off the bases if you want to and fit them with electrics. You know, if you've looked at a YouTube or Google, you'll see some experts in railways, you know, showing you how to convert these into proper end gauge locomotives you can use on your track. These are really nice to convert because the detail and everything on them is absolutely brilliant, you know, considering on how small they are. This one here is, I can't, I can't speak Chinese, but we'll try, Shao Chan 8 or something like that anyway. So that's that one. I do actually know the name of this train. This one's a cool one here. Has a little logo of um, Mao on the front. It's called the DF4D Chairman Mao. Pretty cool <laughs> train. I do like this one actually. I don't know why, but I just don't know. I like that one. And as you say, nicely detailed. Got little light horns on it. As I say, quite cool that would be to convert and put that one on your train set. This one here, it doesn't have a logo on it, but I believe this one is Chinese. It's called the B-52. If I am wrong, I apologise, but I do think this is a Chinese train. So quite cool, this one. Really meaty looking train. You know, detail on it, again, absolutely brilliant. Now, these were only 4 99 when they originally came out, but they did come out now probably 10, 20 years ago, so quite a while ago. But they were good value. If you do like this type of thing, please, you know, have a look at my website. I do have quite a few of these on there. They're only priced, you know, between two, three, something like that, pounds each. I'm not asking the world for them. When they're gone, they're gone. You know, I don't know when I'll get any more because you can't buy them from the wholesale or anything like that anymore. Now, the only reason we get these collections every now and again is from auction houses, but we have to just get what people put into auction, really. So, that's this collection anyway. So, if you do like this type of thing, please subscribe to my videos or have a look at some of us. Thanks for looking. Bye-bye.